Hey, what's going on? Globe here, and today we're back for another Call of Duty video, and as you've seen by the title, we're going to be looking at how to get Call of Duty Advanced Warfare early. So each of these methods I'm going to be showing you, it has worked for me in the past, and when it comes down to getting a Call of Duty early, it's all got to do with trial and error to see which method works for you the best. And now just to show you guys, I have gotten Black Ops 1 about a week and a half early. I got Modern Warfare 3 about a week early in Black Ops 2. I didn't get that game early as I pre-ordered the Care Package Edition and I was going to get that game early but as I said I did pre-order the Care Package Edition and I did want it. So when it comes down to this I'm going to be showing you guys four different methods on how to get Advanced Warfare early. This will definitely also work for uh, getting future Call of Duties earlier as well and just to start off with if you get a hundred plus likes on today's video that would mean the world to me and I'll be pumping out some more advanced warfare videos news tips and tricks for you guys so to start off with we're going to be giving you guys four different methods on how you can get advanced warfare early as I said before it has worked for me in the past so to start off with we are going to be looking at a friend so if you have a friend that works at a retailer shop like GameStop, EB Games, JB hi-fi if you're in Australia or that region just a game shop and you've got, and if you got a friend uh, which works there you can ask him to slip you a game and you give him the full amount of money but he would probably also want extra for that game personally I wouldn't recommend doing this method I have done it in the past and it's worked but I wouldn't recommend doing it just because your friend could lose his job and also you might feel guilty after doing it and if the owner catches you guys doing it he will probably fire your friend and you'll probably have a guilty conscience over doing it and I just wouldn't really recommend that method as it's a bit scumbaggy towards your friend because there's nothing really in for it for your friend but as I said it has worked for me in the past and there's a lot of trial and error with these methods so the second method we're going to be looking at is Amazon now when it comes down to purchasing games or pre-ordering games through Amazon what you can do is you can pre-order advanced warfare early through Amazon and basically what happens is that a week earlier basically they dispatch the games so you get it on time at your house and when it comes down to Amazon sometimes they will deliver it to your house maybe accidentally two days before the release or one day or a week it happened to me in Modern Warfare 3 a week early when I bought it from Amazon because they tried to get it to your house as soon as possible either on the game day or just before but it really comes down to trial and error and what I've noticed with more people is that Amazon is working for them but as I said before sometimes you got to watch out because I did it in Black Ops 1 and I got it a week and a half early whereas I did in Modern Warfare 3 and I only got it a week early so as I said before it does come down to trial and error when it comes down to these things and you've got to find a method that just works for you now the next one this has always worked for me and it always will is it's where you go to a local retailer game shop not the big game shops like GameStop, EB Games, JB Hi-Fi, Kmart, Target none of those the real small ones that have you know not the biggest name around town but they're really only a little store starting around uh, that sells games, equipment, and all those other things. What you can do is that uh, every store basically gets the game a week early to sort out pre-orders and do all that kind of jazz and practically what happens to those little game shops or what you can do is that you can actually go to them and you can bribe them like 20 or 30 dollars extra and you probably don't want to do it at the store owner if you don't know who the store owner is you probably want to do it as a worker who doesn't really care too much or just a worker in general what I have done is that uh, what works for me is that I go with two other friends to a little retailer game store as I said before and what we do is we bribe them 30 dollars each so they make extra money so either way you can spend 30 dollars yourself or you can bring two or three other friends with you and it gives them an option to definitely give you the game as they are making more money off it. Now, coming down to the last methods we're going to be looking at is Gumtree or Craigslist. When it comes down to Craigslist, practically, if you don't know what Craigslist is, you basically meet the person in person and they basically physically give you the game and you give them your money so how this works is that you can find someone who has advanced warfare early meet up with them in your area and for an extra 30 50 dollars you can get the game a week early this worked for me in uh, I think 
Either it was Black, no, it wasn't Black Ops 1, but this method has worked for me as I did it with my friend. And I, I can tell you for a fact, it does work, although you're gonna have to pay a bit more in profit. I know for a fact that I was with my friend doing this, I believe in Black Ops 1. I got my Black Ops 1 through Amazon, but my friend did this method through Craigslist and he showed me. What happens is that there's a kid and I think his dad owned a game shop or something along those lines. And he was going around selling copies and he was selling it for $50 extra and he was making $50 profit so you know not a bad thing for that kid but if you want to get the game early that is a viable option and the last option is probably the most reliable one and that is just to get the day zero edition of advanced warfare which grants you 24 hours early access it's just really pre-ordering the game that's all you got to do is the same amount or the same price as a normal game would be and when it comes down to getting advanced warfare early or any other call of duty early if you're an average gamer who doesn't play too much just or just plays real often I wouldn't suggest doing this but if you're a hardcore youtuber who wants to get videos out tips and tricks all those kind of things out I would definitely recommend doing this uh, I'm not going to be doing it this year as I'm pre-ordering the Xbox one day zero edition with advanced warfare so I'm looking forward to that and I'll also be getting the ps4 version uh, sometime around Christmas so that's basically some methods on how to get advanced warfare early if you have enjoyed today's video a like would be awesome let's even get smash 100 plus likes on today's video if we manage to do that i'll be bringing you guys out some more advanced warfare videos hopefully you guys have all enjoyed and i'll catch you guys later globe out